Hi guys, welcome back. So today we are going to do a new video. I want moms and dads, brothers and sisters, everyone to get involved, okay? I'm going to take a break from the kind of shapes in the preschool class and we're going to do some strengthening exercises. So we're going to do some stuff for our core, our arms and our legs. So I want you all find space and let's all get involved. Have our drinks ready and we're going to start first with our core, okay? So guys, I want everyone to lie down. Find a space on your back, okay? So the first one we're going to do is, okay, I'm just going to talk to you before I lie down. The first one we're going to do is called a scoop hold or a dish. So you're going to be lying flat. I want you to lift your legs, your shoulders and your feet slightly off the ground, keeping your hands on your thighs and keeping your lower back flat on the floor. Try not to arch your back so you don't hurt your back. So I want you to lie down flat. I want you to put your hands on your thighs. I want you to put your chin on your chest. I want you to lift your feet, your shoulders, round to this scoop shape and hold for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, that's one of the most basic, easy exercises we can do. If we repeat that three times and if we hold it each time for ten seconds. Okay, the next one, I want us to lie down flat, I want us to lift a dish again, keeping our back, lower back flat on the floor. Lift our head, or chin, or feet, hold for one, two, three, then we're going to move our feet slightly, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and hold. Okay, they're called scuba steves. It's the exact same dish shape where we're just moving our feet, just to change it up a small bit. Okay, the next one. We are going to lie down flat, put our hands out to the side or down by your side, whichever you prefer. You're going to keep your bum on the floor, lift your feet up, lower very slowly, 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 hold. One, two, three, back up. Lower, slowly, 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 just before it touches the floor. One, two, three. Okay, so we can repeat that exercise a few times, whatever you're able for, maybe two or three times. If you want to push yourself a bit more, you could do a set of five or, <coughs> excuse me, a set of eight. Okay, go grab a quick drink, guys. So with all these core exercises, you do how many reps suit you, okay? The dish hold, whatever you think you can, you can do, we great. Scuba Steve's and the leg raises as well, whatever you can manage, okay? If you're finding those quite easy, we're going to do one more for our core. So remembering that dish shape, we're going to lift our body up to a tuck, and then we're going to go back to a dish shape, okay? So they're called tuck v -sets. So we're going to do 10. Lift a dish, and one, two. If you find it easier, you can grab, it's up to you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, if you find it easier, you can grab your knees when you're in that tuck shape. Okay, trying to get the action all together, it's quite difficult. Start slowly, come up to a nice tuck, and back out to scoop hold, okay? That's all we're gonna do for the first video for our core. The next one, we're gonna start with our arms. So, we're gonna put our arms out, okay? Again, if you feel like you can do it longer, go for it. If not, just do what your body's able for. So, feet together, hands out, and hold. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fingers open, close. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Palms to the ceiling. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
ten. In and out, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Palms back round, small circles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Circle the other way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Throw up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold small up and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, last one, hold, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, well done. Okay guys, trying to keep our arms out, level with our shoulders, trying not to drop them down, don't have them too high, just out straight would be great. If you find it too easy, you can make the reps longer, hold it longer, add in more exercises, even if you want, if you've weights or tins of beans, you can hold them, whatever you can do, whatever you can manage at home. Okay, next one for our arms. So, plank, this is good for our core as well, and for our arms. So we're gonna do plank hold, elbow support hold, plank hold, back to elbow support. So, plank hold for one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dropping, holding a nice shape, dropping to elbows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Back up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Last one. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Okay, when we're doing those, make sure our bum isn't up too high and make sure our belly isn't too low and not arched because we'll strain our backs. Okay, make sure our back is straight or slightly rounded. Grab a quick drink and we're going to do two more exercises for our arms. So with those nice shapes again, we're going to go to a plank, we're going to hold, and we're going to go down, down, up, up. That's one, two, three, down, down, up, up, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten and relax. Okay, last one for our arms, guys. We're going to do press ups. Um, if you prefer, you can do them on your toes. If you find them too difficult, you can drop to your knees, whatever you're able for. Okay, so we're going to start with the easier one. We're going to put our hands and knees. Okay, and we're going to keep our elbows out for this one. We can lift our feet up slightly if we like. And one, two, three. Four, five. Okay, so their elbows out. We can also do elbows in. So make sure our chin is going forward and we're pushing our elbows back and keeping our elbows in. So, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, guys, play around with them. If you find them too easy on your knees, of course, Go up on your toes, make sure we can do some with our elbows out, some with our elbows in, whatever you're able for. Okay guys, last few exercises we're gonna do for our legs, okay? Grab a quick drink and we're gonna finish on our legs. Okay guys, so one of the basic ones we do for our legs is our squat, so our hands out. 
Okay, we want, when we go down, we don't want to lean forwards. We don't want to lean back and arch. Keep our back straight, keep our head neutral. Legs slightly wider than shoulder width. Hands out, and one, two, three. Hands can be optional, four. Out to the side, wherever you prefer, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, there's lots of exercises we can do for our legs. If we can find a space against a wall, we can put our back flat against the wall. We are going to squat down, hold, and you can have your back flat against the wall. That's really going to work your thighs. Okay, and you can do that for however long you're able for. 10 seconds, 30 seconds, one minute, or you could do three reps of 10 seconds. Whatever you're able for. Okay, last one for the legs. We're going to incorporate a little bit of gymnastics. So, I want you to crouch down. You can start with your legs open for this one, because I hope mums and dads are getting involved. I want you to roll back and stand up without using your hands. So in a rounded shape, roll back and stand up. Okay, for the first few, you can keep your legs apart, because it is quite difficult. Roll back, stretch up. Okay, then if you're finding it too easy, you can go from standing, still with your legs apart, roll back, stand up. We can do those in sets of five, eight, ten, whatever you're able for. Last one, let's try the exact same. Back to our shoulder stand, and standing up this time, keeping our legs together. Okay guys, do whatever you're able for. If you find it's too easy with your legs open, join your legs together again. Do them in sets of whatever you're able for, whatever your body is allowing you to do. Okay, if you find them again too easy, we can incorporate a jump, roll back, stand up, and we can add in a little jump. Okay guys, I hope you enjoy something a little bit different today. Get working on those and I'll bring you another video again in a few days. Thanks guys.